It is Friday. That means it's time for our SoCal Spotlight, one of our favorite days of the week. And this week, we are heading 45 miles north of downtown Los Angeles to Lancaster, a beautiful area. And that's where we find our Sheba Turk this morning in the Antelope Valley. And I, how did you pull this assignment? Because this is a good one. It is a great one. And how did I pull this weather to go with it, Jamie? It's absolutely gorgeous out here, as Alex has been telling us. And this weekend is actually the perfect weekend to visit Lancaster. I will tell you why in just a bit. But there's so many gems here to check out when you visit. We'll be starting with this winery. But first, here's what the mayor of Lancaster and some of the residents love about this area. I love it. Uh, I love that there's no traffic. Uh, I love the people. I love uh, the community itself. If, if you see the surroundings, it's everything is from one place to the other. There's space. Uh, there's a lot of trees. You can see the stars at night. Uh, it's just a, a friendly neighborhood. The Lancaster residents we met were eager to tell us what they loved about their city. Ice cream. And when Lancaster's mayor, Rx Paris, speaks of the city, he has the same level of enthusiasm as a kid has for ice cream. You know, there's so many things that I'm proud of. Uh, you know, I've been mayor now for 14 years, so a lot has happened. First, there's the revitalization of downtown Lancaster. We, we rebuilt the downtown. Uh, when I got elected, it was, yeah, you know, I don't know how to describe it, but it was really bad. We totally rebuilt it, and now it's vibrant, you know. Mayor Paris is also proud of the efforts to cut down on crime and build a sense of community. It's having community events. It's getting, it's drilling down into the neighborhoods. Like we have, we have neighborhood impact homes that are run by the churches, but the city funds. There's safe havens within all of these neighborhoods. When it comes to innovation, Lancaster tops the list. The mayor is happy to point out that it is one of the first net zero cities in the world, which means it produces as much energy from sustainable resources like solar power as it consumes. We've won international awards for our, our efforts in climate extinction. The city produces electric buses and requires solar panels on new homes. The city leads in innovation and also in diversity. You know, one of the things I'm really proud of in regards to the people, it's, it was a little known fact, but we are the most integrated city in America, meaning our neighborhoods are integrated. And when you come to visit this diverse community, the mayor didn't hesitate on where you should head first. You have to go to the Boulevard because that's where the restaurants are, that's where the, the El Pack is, that's where the museum is, you know, you, you gotta go to the Boulevard. There are lots of things in a short distance, including concerts and events, and when you're in Lancaster, don't forget to stop and smell the poppies. Anybody who doesn't go to the poppies is out of their mind. I mean, it is, especially this year, this year it is, mind-boggling how, how cool it is. From innovation to diversity, Lancaster has a lot for its residents to take pride in. It's a, it's a good buy. And guys, we're soaking up all those good vibes this weekend. This is actually the perfect weekend to visit Lancaster because the California Poppy Festival is this weekend. We'll have a preview of that later on. But we're starting with one of the gems of Lancaster, the Antelope Valley Winery. This has been around for three decades. And here's the cool part. The grapes they use to make the wine come right here from the Antelope Valley. I spoke with the owner just a few minutes ago. She'll join us soon. She says she's owned this place for 30 years. So I'm excited to learn more about it, guys. Oh, we're excited to learn more about it, too. You said winery, and Jamie and I said, we're in. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be there. We'll be there, That's because you're my kind of girls. That's right. <laughs> my kind of girls. I'll see you soon.